Hello friends, today in this video I am going to discuss about the MCQs on general microbiology and this is the fifth part of the series of 500 MCQs on general microbiology. Okay, so let's start this question answer session for general microbiology. Okay, so first question is indicator present in Christensen's urea medium is phenol red bromothymol blue neutral red or bromocresol purple and the right answer is option a that is phenol red and this is the urea test and which bacteria contain urease enzyme they use this urea agar slant and they give the positive result as pink color of the phenol red indicator and if urease enzymes are not present in bacteria then they give the negative result like this color okay and it is the uninoculated or negative color of the urea agar so move on to the next question that is the indicator of present uh, the indicator present in salmon citrate agar is bromocresol purple bromothymol blue phenol red or methyl red and the right answer is option b that is bromothymol blue and this is the result and this is the this is the normal uh, <clears throat> normal color of the simon citrate agar and if a microorganism contain or bacteria contain the cit uh, contain uh, or utilize the citrate as a source of carbon then they can show the pink color sorry uh, they can show the blue color of bromothymol blue that is the positive reaction and in negative reaction they cannot utilize the citrate okay so next question is the sugar present in nucleic acid that is rna is ribose deoxyribose cytosine or galactose right answer is option a ribose so rna contain the ribose structure that is this and dna contain the deoxyribose structure here one wedge group or hydro hydroxyl group is missing in dna that is a sugar backbone of dna or rna next is the structure of dna molecule was elucidated by porter or edelman watson and crick tisselius and cabot zill and nelson right answer is option b watson and crick Next question is transfer of genetic information from DNA to RNA is called transcription, translation, transduction or transformation. So the transform, uh, so the genetic information transferred from DNA to RNA is called option A that is transcription. Next question is bacterial genome consists of around 10 genes, 100 genes, 1000 genes or 10,000 genes and the right answer is option C that is 1000 genes okay so move on to the next question that is ribose sugar is absent in RNA DNA tRNA or rRNA and the right answer is option B that is DNA And this is the structure of DNA that is the sugar backbone of DNA so move on to the next the phenomenon of transformation was studied in staphylococci escherichia pneumococci or bacillus right answer is option C that is pneumococci and what is the transformation transformation is the transfer of naked DNA from one dead cell to another cell so suppose this is a cell where the cell death after the cell death the naked dna comes from the dead cell and they if they transfer to the new bacterial cell and that cell and uh, that and that dna combined with the bacterial genome then it is called the transformation process okay 
So transfer of genetic material by the naked DNA is known as the transformation. So next is Griffith is associated with transformation, conjugation, transduction or transcription. So the answer is option A that is transformation. Next question is Lederberg and Tatum describe the phenomenon of phagocytosis, transformation, transduction or conjugation. Right answer is option D that is conjugation. Move on to the next. That is, so sorry. Uh, so explanation is so conjugation. Conjugation means the transfer of extracellular chromosomal DNA like plasmid, transfer of one plasmid from a donor cell to a recipient cell by the pillars. So through pillars, one plasmid is transferred from one DNA, sorry, one bacterial cell to another like this in this process. And at the end, both donor DNA and the recipient DNA both uh, have the one copy of the plasmid. Okay, so this is the conjugation process transfer of DNA by pillars. Next one is the process of direct uptake and absorption of fragments of bacterial DNA by the recipient is known as transformation, transduction, conjugation or transcription. Right answer is option A that is transformation. Okay, so up, uptake of the fragments of bacterial DNA that means naked DNA uptake of naked DNA from one bacterial cell to another this is the process uptake of the naked DNA okay and next one is which of the following process is most likely to be inhibited by the presence of extracellular nucleases options are transduction transformation conjugation or transposition right answer is option B that is transformation because because this naked DNA naked DNA can be destroyed by the by the nucleases okay so that is the answer is transformation okay so next one is transmission of a piece of DNA from one cell to another by a bacteriophage is called Translation, transcription, transformation or transduction and the right answer is option D that is transduction. So what is the process of transduction? So in transduction process the bacteriophage if a bacteriophage infect a bacterial cell they infect or inject their viral DNA into the bacterial cell and that bacterial and that viral cell can be independently replicate or it can be incorporated into the bacterial genome okay and then they can uh, replicate their viral genes okay so this is the process of transduction by which viral DNA incorporated into the bacterial cell so next one is multiplication and release of progeny fudge causing lysis of the host cell is the property of Temperate fudge, prophage, virulent fudge or lysogenic fudge. Right answer is option C that is virulent, virulent fudge. So virulent fudge can cause lysis of the host cell. So that's why this is the virulence fudge, virulent fudge and next one is extra chromosomal genetic elements are called ribosomes, plasmids, mesosomes lysosomes and the right answer is option B that is plasmids. So plasmi plasmids are commonly found as small circular double-stranded DNA molecules in bacteria a normal component of prokaryotes. Okay here are the double-stranded single circular chromosome. Okay and they are physically separated from and replicate independent. They can replicate independently and carry genes that may benefit survival of the organisms. Example, they carry the antibiotic resistance genes and may be modified to express proteins of interest. That means they can act as a vector in molecular cloning. Okay, so next one is plasmids are responsible for cell respiration, cell division, mutation or drug resistance. And the right answer is option D that is drug, drug resistance. Okay, so next one is, so here we can see that this, this is a uh, plasmid structure. 
plasmid DNA structure and here a origin of replication is present where the replication starts and here is the antibiotic resistance genes are present. Next one is F factor refers to fertility plasmid, functional function plasmid, functional plasmid, flagella plasmid or fragmented plasmid. So F factor represent F rep represent the fertility. Answer is option A that is fertility. Here we can see that F plus plus plasmid means fertility uh, plasmid have a plasmid which can transfer their DNA from one cell to another by conjugation through a pillars. Okay, so in this way one copy of the DNA plasmid DNA can be transferred from F plus cell to F minus cell, fertility plus cell to fertility minus cell or recipient cell. Okay, so in this way both both of this cell will be F plus or fertility positive cell. Okay, so next one is F factor integrates with bacterial chromosome to form RTF, HRF, HFR or F minus or F plus. Right answer is option B that is HFR that is high frequency recombination. So F factor integrate with the bacterial chromosome that means F factor plasmid when the F factor plasmid F plasmid incorporated into the host bacterial chromosome it form a HFR, HFR form that is called high frequency recombination plasmid. Okay. So next one is the bacteria which serve as recipient in a in F factor mediated conjugation are HFR, F prime bacteria, F minus bacteria, F plus bacteria and right answer is option C, F minus bacteria, the bacteria which serve as recipient. So recipient bacteria is F minus and the donor bacteria is F plus bacteria. Okay. So next one is which of the following statement concerning conjugation involving F plus and F minus cells is true. F minus cell carries sex factors. Only double standard DNA is transferred from F plus to F minus. F plus cells cannot rep replicate in the absence of chromosomal replication or all the genes are transferred to recipient F minus cell. Answer is option D. That is all the genes are transferred to recipient F minus cells by conjugation from F plus to F minus. Okay. So next one is a genetic element capable of inserting itself into a variety of both chromosomal and non-chromosomal DNA is called prophage or F factor or transposons or plasmid and the right answer is option C that is transposon. So transposon can insert their DNA from one site to another site that is like this. This is a DNA. And this is the transposon DNA which excise uh, by excise by the transposon genes to like this and they add this transposon or this DNA into another site of the same DNA. Okay, so this is called the transposition. And the next one is the bacteria harboring prophage are called lethal bacteria, lysogenic bacteria, lytic bacteria or avirulent bacteria. Right answer is option B that is lysogenic bacteria. So here we can see that <coughs> in transduction the viral DNA incorporated into the bacterial cell and if this viral DNA is incorporated in the bacterial genome then it is called the prophage and this process is called the lysogeny. Okay. And if the uh, viral DNA is replicated independently, then it go through the lysis cycle of like lysis cell cycle of bacteriophage. Okay. So next one is the heritable ch uh, change. Heritable change in a genome is conjugation, transformation, mutation, or transduction. And the right answer is option C. That is mutation. Heritable change in genome is called mutation like this here is the normal and after mutation it is changed in the one base this here which cause a 
heritable change in the genome okay next one is mutational drug resistance involves resistance to one drug resistance to combination of drugs high degree of resistance none of the above right answer is option a resistance to one drug okay and multiple drug resistance is spread by mutation conjugation transduction or transformation right answer is option b that is conjugation multiple drugs resistance can be spread by conjugation here we can this is the bacterial dna and here uh, r factor plasmid resistance factor r means resistance r factor plasmid is present and through conjugation by conjugation through these pillars this r factor plasmid or resistant plasmid go to the recipient cell and they are also provide the drug resistance to the another bacteria or donor bacteria by the resistant factor plasmid okay next one sorry so this is the last question okay thank you for watching this video